Hi, I'm Graham Howe from Finding Country Coventry. And I'm Nick Barker from Finding Country Coventry. And we'd love to welcome you here today to the Manor House, situated in the village of Ostry, which you've got the local convenience store with post office, the local public house, even the local bridge club too. It's moments from Atherston where you've got an array of further shopping facilities as well as uh, other restaurants. And you've also got the railway station with links to London. But you probably want to know a little bit more about the home, Nick. Indeed. So today we're being Lords of the Manor at Manor House. This grey two listed building with a beautiful Jacobean staircase, which has numerous reception rooms, lovely country style kitchen, plus outbuilds with a little equestrian twist. Let's go and have a look. So as you walk in, there's three amazing reception areas. Graham's going to go to the east wing now, see you soon. And we're going to look at the amazing fireplaces and the abundance of character these three rooms have. Leading from the three reception rooms, we get to the reason why this property is Grade 2 listed, and that's the Jacobean staircase here, which leads up to four double bedrooms with one that has a huge ensuite and family bathroom. Well, welcome to the fourth reception room. My colleague Nick's already told you about the other three. There's actually four with this formal dining room. You've got the exposed wooden beams, the original hooks that were coming over there. You've got the door opening onto the alfresco eating. And behind me, what a magnificent fireplace and hearth. Welcome to the principal bedroom of Manor House. And what a room we have here. Imagine if the walls could speak with all the history. We've got the dual aspect lending in that natural light, the exposed wooden beam, feature fireplace, then opening onto this remarkable size ensuite where I think Nick's already waiting for me. I've got the big town and you've got the small town. Perfect. We're going to enjoy a shower and bath while we let you enjoy the rest of the property. And welcome to the office in Manor House. You can see what a remarkable room this is. Room for at least two, if not three people. We've got the exposed wooden beams above us. We've got the natural light coming in through the window and the wall lights. But holding that thought just there, we've got one more thing to show you as well, because this property does also boast its own potential self-contained annex. Let's go and show you. So another bonus that Manor House has to offer is this two bedroom detached property. Let's go and have a look. The two bedroom detached property has a lounge, a kitchen diner, with two double side bedrooms, modern bathroom, and fully air conditioned. We have this building behind me here, the outbuilding. Now this has no grade two listed on it, so it could easily be converted into another annex, movie room, gym room. There are so many options there. Situated just behind that 
is the stable block, which Nick mentioned earlier being that equestrian twist, offering you four stables, one being able to house not only the mother horse, but the foal as well. I'm gonna take you through the herb and berry courtyard. In the distance, you can see that brick wall with the door that will be taking us into the secret garden. Follow me. And welcome to the formal gardens of Manor House. You can see in the distance, we've got the good life with the raised vegetable plot. Also, we've got the beehive in the background creating that lovely buzz. Also at the same it's such an established, mature garden with an array of shrubs, trees, and flower beds. Oh, hi there, Nick, how are you? So you must admit, this is a fantastic property. 100%, and thank you. It was really finished off with your barbecue skills there. But more importantly than anything, if you would like to arrange your exclusive viewing on this manor house, please do not hesitate to get in contact with myself or with Nick Barker. Take care, and it's good night from me, and good night from him. And thanks for staying tuned. <laughs>